Hey guys, this is Deb Before You See Me with one of my tech reviews. I haven't done a review like this in a long time. I'm using QuickTime Player so you won't hear any sound. I'm using the Apogee mic. It's a great first mic for uh, people who want to, you know, just record. Um, okay, so first of all, thank you guys for t almost 10,000 views on my first N64 adapter video. That's just great. I, can't, I couldn't even imagine having that much. Okay, so what you want to do is get Project 64, and I like the K version because it can net play. Um, warning before, you need Wine or some other program to run this or it will not work. So the funny thing about this adapter is on Windows, you know, we had to do all that extra setup, even though the box said, oh, no extra setup required. Well, believe it or not, not on Mac. So what you got to do is go to settings and just, you know, you want to put in N range direct input 1.61 and, you know, select that. Um, the old Project 64 had a better N range, but, you know, this one is updated and, you know, I like it. So go ahead and hit assign keys and then make sure you're at USB gamepad 2. And if your controller is plugged in the first slot, there's the modifiers. So if you need to uh, make your sensitivity a little bit better, you do that and then you assign the rest of the keys. I opened up Super Mario 64 multiplayer. But as you'll see, my controller is going to work fine. Uh, there was me trying to test out the sound to see if it would work, but it didn't. And there you go. My controller is working, and of course you'd need a second person or a second controller or the keyboard to play Luigi, but I didn't do that in this video. But yeah, so thank you guys. I hope this helps. Uh, you know, it's not that hard, and that's me showing the C buttons work, and that was the problem with the last video. So I hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.